Good morning, my Librans. Happy Air Sign Day, everybody. Let's get this reading in. I'm using Ethereal Visions for the main deck this week, and I have, um, I don't know why I forget it every single time. It is called Craft Tarot for the Clarifying Deck. The links to both these decks are found down below in the description box. So I have an Eight of Cups to a King of Wands. It feels like some of you are walking towards this King of Wands. Could be walking towards this energy, walking towards, or you're walking towards the, and possessing this energy. A king of wands walks with confidence. A king of wands rises. I feel like it's getting a lot of attention. I feel like that's what it feels like. It's like a moment to shine here, king of wands. What's below the king of wands here? King of cups reverse. And a nine, of, yeah, it could be new love for some of you. Um, it just feels good, you know? It feels good. Four of Swords reverse, Seven of Pentacles reverse. Probably got out of something here. And could have been single, could just be in between, but it feels like you have a new energy going on. All right, Libra. Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. Libra, if you are a Libra, know a Libra. Feel like being a Libra. Librans, I'm glad you're here. You could be a Libra and this resonates. You could be dealing with a Libra. It could resonate as a main story, and Libra could be the cross watcher. This reading could be about a Libra or for a Libra. Take it as it resonates. Collect the messages. For my Librans, collect the messages. The strength, Leo, it's the strength card, Libra. What's below that? The, you. I never pull it. Six, I, the Three of Cups. I, I have to look. Four of Cups and the Ten of Swords. Yeah. So I feel like you did get out of something. And then there was this period of error. Eh, but three of cups, I feel like maybe somebody asked you out and you're just, let's see how it goes. It must be going well. Oh, wow. Okay, what is the reason for the reading for Libra? What is the reason for the reading for the Librans here? Click. What is the reason for the reading? I feel nervous. Why do I feel so nervous? Feeling hot, Libra. What's the reason for the reading? The seven of, seven of cups. Yeah, seven, I thought it was seven of swords. Seven of cups. Not sure where this is headed. Not sure how they... I think well, you should know how a King of Wands feels. Seven of Cups. All right. Are you ready? How is this? I just... It feels good. It feels like you're still in fantasy stages here. What's in the past? What's in the past? The Devil Reverse. Capricorn. That's what it feels like. It's like you got out of something and just been a four cups kind of just holding your own here. What is on your mind? What is on Libra's mind? What is on the Libra's mind? The artist. It is new. The artist is Major Arcana number 23. There's 20, there's two special Major Arcanas in this deck, the Well and the Artist. I feel like you, the idea of the artist is a vessel, like you are the vessel, you know, and things born are ready to come out. Like what you've been keeping within, you're ready to put out in the world. You're ready to paint. You're ready to, to paint your masterpiece. You're ready to be seen. You are going down, for some of you, depending on your careers, it could be like, this is what I'm going to be known for. This, I, you know, it's it, there's a moment where, something you do is just it doesn't matter what you did before or who you did before you're going to be known for this that's what I, I that's what i'm feeling here very specific what's in the near future what's in the near future for libra i just get creation mode with that artist what's in the near future for libra like very magician like and the Empress Reverse. There you are with Taurus. One more card. What's in the near future for Libra? And the Sun Reverse. And let's see. Let's see where we're going here. It feels like you. What is Libra up to here? Okay, what is the strength card? What is the strength card? Leo energy right here. What is the strength card? The two of cups reverse. Cancer, why the two of cups reverse? 
Uh, you could honestly be working on yourself, but at the same time hoping there would be a comeback around with someone that there could have been a breakup or somebody's still holding on to you because the strength card is holding on tight. Nine of Wands is, is, you know, like it's a push through. You're almost, you know, it's the almost their card, but it is holding on to hope that something that's now broken, it can be severed. What's influencing this is you, Queen of Swords, not backing down, not changing your mind. You created boundaries. And I, yeah, that's what it feels like. What's the Queen of Swords doing here? Libra energy. What's the Queen of Swords? Five of Cups reverse and the Seven of Swords reverse. Five of Cups reverse is new love. It's no longer focused on the past. It's only looking forward. Seven of Swords reverse. It really feels like somebody wants to try again with you. That's what it feels like. Seven of Swords reverse, it can be making amends. Somebody wants to try again. I think that's what we're having here. Three of Cups, Hermit reverse. Yeah, that's okay. What's the Seven of Cups reason for the reading, Scorpio? Seven of Cups, reason for the reading, Scorpio energy. Why the Seven of Cups? Ace of Wands. I feel like you're going to hear from somebody or you are reaching. It could be you, Libra, reaching out to someone. Seeing if there's still hope on a connection. What's the Ace of Wands doing here? Nine of Cups reverse. Seven of Pentacles reverse. Not much going on. You know, it's like if somebody's reaching out to you, it feels like they're like lonely that night. Maybe they're drinking that night because it's nine of cups reverse. Could be nine bottles of beer empty. And it's just like, I have nothing to lose at this point. I feel like you're going to get a message. I really do. I feel like somebody's going to be like, well, you know, like, can we just start over? Can we, because I saw that three of cups. Can we start as friends? What's the devil reverse in the past? Capricorn, what's, look at how Scorpio's death can we get a Libra reading without Scorpio? I don't think so. There's always Scorpio in your reading. Eight of Swords and a Death Reverse. Three of Pentacles Reverse and a Justice Reverse. I feel like you could have ended something. And somebody, I feel like the, there's a comeback around here. What is the artist on your mind? I feel like this is where your focus is. I feel like your focus is on a legacy, on building your pentacles, building your wealth building something to you know building long-term stability and then i feel like somebody emotionally you know is going to hit you up in the dms or something what is the artist here on your mind oh, ten, too 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 much what is the artist on libra's mind what is the artist on libra's mind Page of Wands reverse. Four of Pentacles, Three of Swords reverse. It really feels really focused. Page of Wands reverse on your mind is saying, no, I need to, I feel like you're, you are a magician. You're creating something. That's, that's all I really got on that. The artist is you creating something you want to be known for. It's, it's really important to you. It's really personal to you. And Page of Wands reverse, Three of Swords reverse. And even this Four of Pentacles is holding your own. Like, I'm good over here. I want that Ten of Pentacles. This is where I am. Three of Swords reverse. It's just like you don't have time for a real relationship. And maybe you dated and somebody's coming back around to see if you would go out again. or And maybe they wanted a relationship. And you're saying, no, this is where my focus is. I just don't have time for this. Feel like you have a lot of changes going on in your life too what's the sun reverse and the empress reverse in the near future the sun reverse and the empress reverse in the near future leo and libra the sun reverse why is that the king of wands there is the king of wands again you i feel like you being a queen of swords is also the king of wands but you i always say this in readings every successful person every king upright it has a queen of swords right below it. You are a king of wands supported by your queen of swords. 
you are very limiting. I feel like you're limiting the people you have around you. You are really focused on where you really want to be. Maybe you want to buy a house. Maybe you want more money in your bank account. Maybe you want to live a, a, like finance, have financial freedom, you know? Um, whatever this is, you don't need, you just, you, I don't feel like you want to date around. That's just my feeling. And maybe someone you casually saw and they're coming back around because they want a real relationship. You don't want, you don't have time for it is what it feels like. Why the Empress reverse? Why the Empress? I feel like you're very self-focused. What's the, I don't feel like you're going out a whole lot. What's the Empress reverse of the near future? Ten of Cups. What's the Ten of Cups? What is the Ten of Cups here? And the moon reverse. And the ace, there's ace, there's the, there's a ten of swords, ace of pentacles, ace of cups coming in, nine of pentacles. This is what's coming in. <laughs> ten of swords tells me there's always already been an ending. And I feel like they got over something. I feel like they were kind of hurt for a while, but they got over it and they're coming in like I've you know, I've grown a lot from this. I feel like they're being offering you an Ace of Cups, Ace of Pentacles, but the Nine of Pentacles tells me, I really feel this is what, what we're, there's something about this energy when they're around you. They want to be associated with you. For instance, I mean, maybe you do well, like you do well financially or you do well in a career and they're just, you know, there's something about you. I feel like you get attention, but you don't want the attention. It's like you're not craving it. It's just you do something very well. That's what I'm getting. You do something very well. And, and getting attention is almost effortless. People see what you do. This is a person. I don't think it's like that for them. So you got a yeah nine of pentacles. I feel it's just the way they feel when they're around you and they miss you. There, there's nothing negative to this this energy at all, but I just feel like you don't have time for it. What I did kind of feel here, Libra, I'll be honest, a Ten of Cups and an Empress Reverse, I feel like some Libras, let's just talk third party. If you are, let's say, dating, engaged, married, and this was like some type of affair thing you had, that affair thing, it's almost like, be careful that it doesn't turn into a fatal attraction kind of thing. Because I feel like you are self-focused, like maybe you're about to get married, or maybe you are, you're you know, trying to keep that intact, the Ten of Cups. This is where your focus is. So everything you do is for this. Somebody wants in. I, I, just be careful that doesn't turn in. I don't know why I got fatal attraction going on here. Full reverse, Six of Cups, it's like, I, it's not like it ended terrible. You just don't want to, you know, you, you just don't want to do it. Whatever they, they're they offering you. That's what it feels like. All right, my Librans, have a great rest of your week, and I'll see you guys soon. Take care.